it's rough. <laughs> but I got you. So here we go. So Buzz O is going to be the tag that he's using right now for his Olimar. Um, I didn't actually see what all of his, his differences and controls are. Uh, but I think, I know for a fact that like when he's playing this character, he does like to use Smash Stick instead of Tilt Stick, which makes total sense. I mean, it's Olimar, so. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, pivot smash is probably going to be a yeah. lot better than uh, pivot. What is it? Tilt. A pivot, yeah, pivot L tilt. Just dump yeah, it. Yeah, it. <laughs> yeah, just going to be button checking right now, checking everything's fine. And we see the little bit of movement tech. You know, you got the the beer verses and the uh, wave bounces coming from the buzz as well. Uh, it looks like they're just about ready to go. All right. So Zenos, I feel like I, I've definitely seen him play before, so um, it should, should be a pretty good match coming up for us. Just again, no, he is playing against you know one of the top, in my opinion, top ten players in, in the world right now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and then also uh, just a matchup that's not favorable for him. So yeah, upset of the century if it happens. <laughs> All right, but here we go, Pokemon Stadium two. Not, I guess FD for the button check, Pokemon Stadium for the for the actual match. Yeah. All right, let's get into it. All right, let's see what the round start's going to be. Uh, okay, I was like, are we, we actually get into it. Yes. <laughs> so this, this is the one thing that we're going to have to do uh, that you have to worry about when you're playing against Olimar. Is basically, one, just getting Pikmin off of you, but also getting Pikmin off of you safely. Because sometimes Olimar uh, players, like when you panic and try to get Pikmin off of you, you put yourself in a bad position for like throwing out aerials and stuff, just mm -hmm. like in neutral, but they're pretty close to you and you're not actually trying to hit them. So uh, sometimes you'll see the buzz drop a couple of those Pikmin on you and then run up and up smash to get that free damage because either you didn't get the Pikmin off or you tried to get the Pikmin off and it didn't uh, work off and uh, work out and now you're at like 90%. So yeah. Looks like Xenos is trying to keep himself right outside of the Pikmin arc range. He's just waiting for him. And then when he thinks he has a read on his defensive option, he's been going with like that dagger or grab instead. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's keeping a very careful game right now. He has to. I mean, if you let yourself get hit by Pikmin, it gets, especially as a light character like Pichu, it's very difficult to come back. Okay. Nice anti, uh, anti, uh, I guess anti approach up smash right there from uh, the buzz. So. So yeah, it's probably gonna be a pretty slow uh, developing game here, but it's not but it's anyone's fault except for the fact that Pichu doesn't want to take damage for free. And also you can't really just run into Olimar. So it's just like it's just the nature of the game at this point in time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I gotta be careful when Monique's out though. That purple pick and it'll cause a hitbox and then you said send it to double just like that. So it's very difficult oh. to get called out on your approach option and the down smash gonna be able to clip that quick attack, not quite reaching the ledge, unfortunately. Yeah, that was that was a pretty easy one right there. Uh, for for the buzz to pick up on, so. Uh oh. All right, still stuck at the ledge. Still gonna make it back though. Ooh, that up air! It looked like it hit him up from the side and picked him back up. Yeah. So this is like, uh, again, man. Uh, you know, he's got the damage here on the buzz. It's just how is he gonna safely get this uh, this KO or at least pressure the buzz into getting the KO? What runs in, gets the dash attack. Oh, okay. Getting a little tricky with the thunder. Still trying to chase him down, though. Put him off stage. Okay, yeah. Oh, the oh. Air. oh, unfortunate. He gets a drag down. He just doesn't get all the hits. That could have been easily the kill, unfortunately. Yeah, I think because that, that, that fast fall. If he would have not fast fallen, that should, probably should have been it. Back throw. Not going to be enough, obviously, but at least putting him back off stage. Oh, oh nice yeah. recovery here from the buzz. Mm -hmm. He recognized his opportunity at the end of that back air, and he just said, okay, I'm going to hit you back up. Come back to the stage just fine. Back to Xeno's waiting. <laughs> Figuring out how to make his make his way in. He doesn't want to go down two socks to to three. Or one sock to three, excuse me. But he's gonna do just that. A bad uh, approach option there. But Olimar and just in dump just the buzz too is so good at being able to space around whatever you're trying to do to get in yeah. on his own. F tilt, okay. Yeah, finally at those super hyper sense it'll work out, especially against, you know, a light character like Olimar. All right, yeah, but the thing is, like, he's already down to his last stock. He's at 51%, man. And, you know, you're a super light character. You're still doing damage to yourself because you are playing Pichu. Even though it's, it's like, way le less uh, damage or kind of more negligible in this game than it has been in, like, Melee. But regardless, yeah. you know, you're still still light. And any yeah, damage yeah. matters. Oh, okay, back on the stage. Luckily for him. Yeah, you definitely got to get, like, a Void combo or something to have a chance. And But he's still, <laughs> the damage is stacking up. Finally going to go around that down smash. And he's got to piss up a big opportunity, but he goes for the runoff there. 
He's been going for these really hard reads on edge guards, but he's not quite finding them. And the right. has been slowly able to come around every single time. All right. Oh, okay, looking for the F smash. Out of the shield with the back air, but nothing gonna uh, nothing gonna connect for either one of them. I like that up tilt back air, just pushing back off stage. Oh, I, oh, that's unfortunate. I like the idea though. He didn't yeah. want to land on stage because he would have landed with some lag. The bus probably could have tried to like back air or down air, uh, and he had he had a purple Pikmin too, so that's probably game. But uh, fortunate for him, he just shot a little too far past that ledge, and uh, well, end up as ding. Yep, didn't quite work out for him there. But yeah, like I said, or like you said, I, I like the idea <laughs> of from yeah, that. Yeah, definitely like the idea. Just mm -hmm. the execution was a little off. Needed, needed. I, I guess he either needed a slider angle or he needed to go like, uh, kind of like almost straight down so he like yeah. <laughs> rode the stage but also grabbed the ledge. So. Alrighty, here we go. Let's get this next one underway. Mm-hmm. I mean, he took a stock off. I mean, that's, that's real good, right? <laughs> that's what it is. Yeah, he got a stock, right? Mm-hmm. All right. <laughs> yep, I guess. This, this is exactly what it is, man. <laughs> exactly what it is, so. Yeah, sometimes you just gotta play the game, man. I say, yeah, you, you, you know, you wanna, like, have something to talk about, but sometimes you just gotta let the game speak for itself, man. And, and yeah. they're standing, <laughs> like, and, and they're standing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Stuck at the ledge, but uh, able to make it back. Oh, but he's going in super hard, and it makes him lose the control again. Unfortunate as you know, he's gotta get himself out of another ledge trap situation. The bus really trying to read out a jump there. Wow, just just barely out the range of that uh that Pikmin F smash. So, okay, finally gets some damage here. Gets the uh oh okay, gets a little repeat too. Whoa, that was a big bet. He must have thought that the bus was gonna try to jump over him. And honestly, if he would have got that read, I would have thought he was a genius. So <laughs> yeah, 200 level IQ, but not yeah. quite gonna come to fruition there. He's using the thunder troll, kill the Pikmin, but now yellow's online, so we'll be vulnerable or vul invulnerable to that lightning. Okay, wow, runs. Okay. I like that. Runs up straight up on him. Yeah, so he's life. been it. Oh! Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, one, he's been able to keep his stock way longer than I expected, and two, yeah, man, like, you don't wanna do a standard get up against Pikachu, uh, Pichu's F Smash, man. It, it's a long lasting move, multiple hitboxes, so it's really easy for, for it to scoop you up. And uh, luckily for, uh, I guess, Xenos, I think he hit, like, just the last hitbox. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The one that matters. Yeah, very, very important there. Okay, gonna get clipped. By that, it looked like it was just a, just a Pikmin toss that killed, but I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, he was just doing a great job of moving around and navigating through the Pikmin arcs, like I said before. Oh, but White Pikmin has the furthest distance. Gonna get clipped there, not gonna get that Nair to grab. Okay, mm getting the up, uh, the up smash there. Looking for the up airs as well. Uh, Xeno's having a hard time getting back down to the ground right now, so obviously he's gonna just wait it out. He's like, you know what? <laughs> you got it, bro. One taunt, not gonna get anything else though. All right, oh. so the bus kind of backed off, gave him space. Uh, a lot of them work. Oh, I like that. Good recovery on, onto the middle platform here. Uh, but the oh, buzz now with the two up. purples, yeah. Mm -hmm. Waiting for that spot dodge and just uh, decided to keep his floaty drift. And another anti-air up smash. Gonna clean out that stock super quickly there. Yeah, that's a rough one. Okay, here we go. I was like, oh, I thought, well, yeah, he's way lighter. He's way lighter. I thought he was gonna be able to get a double up smash, but one, uh, Pichu being so light, I feel like he doesn't get that full combo. But still, even without getting the double up smash, 53% on Pichu, uh, still quite a bit of damage. Yeah, might as well be a double up smash at that point. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, the Monique, is that enough? Not quite, actually. I, oh, but this time around it will be enough. Just back air to down smash. It's a that's double a flash one. there. Yeah, that's yeah. always rough. Dude, I think a false finish needs to be, uh, I think that needs to be, like, like worked on in, in 3.0. <laughs> Cause I feel like, I feel like I, at first I only saw false finish like every now and then. Now I feel like everything's a false finish, dude. <laughs> yeah. And everyone's so. getting good at their DI again.